Lama 3.1 70 billion is a very good model, no doubt about that. Not only the benchmarks prove it, but the real-world applications of this model has proven it beyond the doubt that it matches the performance of closed-source celebrated models like OpenAI's GPT-4 O and Thropix Cloud and Google's Gemini Pro. That is why I have seen efforts being done to bring the 70 billion model down to commodity GPUs, especially equal to or below 24 GB of VRAM. In this video, I am going to show you this brand new fine-tuned model called as Meta Lama 3.1 70 billion instruct but with AQLM. If you don't know what Meta's Lama 3.1 is, it is a collection of multilingual LLMs of pre-trained and instruction-tuned generative models in 8 billion, 70 billion and 405 billion sizes. This is just text in text out model. The Lama 3.1 instruction tuned text only models are optimized for multilingual dialogue use cases and have outperformed many of the available open source and closed chat models on common industry benchmarks. In this video, I will be showing you how this model has been compressed by using this AQLM technique and PV tuning. We will also learn what exactly is meant by AQLM and PV and then we will install it locally and then play around with this model. Before I do that, let me give a huge shout out to Mast Compute who are sponsoring the VM and GPU for this video. If you are looking to rent a GPU on affordable prices, I will drop the link to their website in video's description. Plus, I am also going to give you a coupon code of 50% discount on a range of GPUs. Now, before we get it installed, there are two terminologies which you need to, or three terminologies I would say, which you need to uh, be really crystal clear about. First and foremost, what exactly this quantization mean? Because this model, Lama 3.170 billion instruct AQLM, is an AQLM quantization of the actual 70 billion model. When we say quantization, quantization is a technique used to reduce the memory and computational requirement of LLMs. It involves representing the model's weights and activations using fewer bits, typically 1 to 2 bits per parameter instead of the standard 32 bit floating point numbers. This compression reduces the model's precision but allows for faster execution and smaller storage requirement, making it possible to run complex models on smaller devices or the GPUs with lesser VRAM. This model is a quantized version but quantized with AQLM. AQLM stands for Additive Quantization for Large Language Models. AQLM is a new quantization technique specifically designed for compressing LLMs to extremely small sizes, 2 to 3 bits per parameter. It uses additive quantization to break down weight matrices into smaller parts and optimizes compression across different parts of the model. AQLM achieves excellent compression results maintaining model accuracy while reducing memory requirements making it quite suitable for deploying LLMs on resource-constrained devices. Another term which we need to learn is this PV which stands for PV tuning. PV tuning is a fine-tuning framework that improves the performance of compressed large language models. It is designed to work with quantization techniques like AQLM to optimize the compressed model's weights for better accuracy. PV tuning generalizes and improves upon existing fine-tuning strategies providing convergence, guarantees, and outperforming previous methods in highly performant models like Llama and Mistral. By using PV tuning, developers can achieve better compression ratios without sacrificing model accuracy enabling efficient deployment of LLMs on smaller devices. So I hope that now we uh, understand what quantization, AQLM and PV tuning is. Let's go to my terminal where I am running this Ubuntu 22.04 and GPU card is NVIDIA RTX A6000 with 48 GPU of VRAM but you can run this model on 24 GPU of VRAM but not less than that. Let me clear the screen. Let me create the Conda environment. 
which will create a virtual environment to keep everything separate let's wait for it to get activated and conda is created let's install all the prerequisites and you see that towards the end i am installing aqlm on gpu besides my torch transformer and other stuff so let's wait for it to get installed this is going to take a couple of minutes so all the prerequisites are done next up let's launch our jupyter notebook so that we could install it in the browser environment so let's wait for it to get launched so the jupyter notebook is launched let's import the libraries which we have installed and then let's download the model and the model has started downloading i think the size is around 24 gig so let's wait for it to get downloaded it is going to take a bit of our time and the model and the tokenizers are downloaded and now we can do the inference so the first step i am asking it the question as what is the smallest country in the world so let me run it let's wait for it i'm also displaying the execution time there you go and the answer is spot on that smallest country in the world is vatican city which is an independent city so the answer is correct let's try out another one in the next one i'm asking it run write 10 sentences ending with the word beauty now the thing which i'm testing it for is that we have compressed quantized a 70 billion model into two bit and the size is just 24 gig now so for that i'm just looking to see if there is any loss in accuracy but you can see that most of the answer they are spot on so it even has produced this answer where every sentence is ending with the word beauty which is really cool amazing stuff let's try out this one that how many r's are there in the word strawberry so this one it failed which seven, i'm not sure uh, 70 billion model in full it was able to answer this but this one has failed whereas the 8 billion lama 3.1 also gave the wrong answer and also but the 405 billion was also correct okay so at least we found one thing which was um, correct by the full model okay let's try out one more okay next one i'm just asking model a negative question that how can i make a conversation awkward let's see if model responds to me or just simply refuses it taking a bit of a time okay surprisingly this time model took a bit of a time and we will see it in the execution time but look at this it says i must preface that making a conversation awkward is not necessarily a goal to strive for and then it is just telling me how to do it tongue-in-cheek tips overly personal make assumption and then use humor at the wrong time awkward silences bring up converse, controversial topics and all that stuff so it took around 29 seconds okay so this is interesting that or a bit of a hard question i would say or unusual question it takes a bit of a time okay let's try out a coding one so i'm asking you to draw the mental broad set which is a geometrical construct here let's wait for it and there you go for the geometry um, the code is fine looks really good very high quality so, uh, and then it has also given us a synopsis of the code and then it is also even telling us what to install in order to run that but took a bit of a time like more than 25 seconds anyway but all in all really good effort and i think it is quite big that now we can even run 70 billion model with a very decent accuracy on just 24 gp of vram and above that is good so hopefully this will improve and then sometime soon we would also be able to run 405 billion lama 3.1 model on such commodity hardware on single gpu with 24 gp or even less so that's it guys i will drop the link to this model in video description play around with it let me know what do you think if you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you're already subscribed, please share it among your network as it helps. Thank you for watching.